I'm going to talk a little bit about interlinking. Um, people that have been through our courses are, are pretty savvy in this area, but I'm even seeing some that have that um, still are not are not quite doing it. it Inter, let me just say, interlinking, inter, that's linking your blog posts together, relevant, they must be relevant. Linking them together is a huge, huge factor in SEO. It can make a world of difference for your website. If you're not interlinking, you are just missing out. This is really a big deal. Um, I am here, and uh, Leslie shared this little tip last week in our VIP group, over here, you get, when you go to your blog post, I went to post and I went to all. This right here shows you some of these are drafts, so there's nothing there. Um, shows you how how many articles that post links to, and then you come over here, and I might be getting them confused, but it tells you um, how many. How, one, uh, let me read it. <laughs> Number of internal links in this post. Um, text in the help tab okay any okay let me just say this let me just say it all right one is how many links you have from this article going to other articles and the other column is how many other of your blog posts link back to this blog post so you want to see some numbers here if you go to your dashboard you know and, and you see nothing you got some serious work to do and you can tell by looking at this that we have some serious work to do on pajama affiliates so I'm gonna make this easier I'm gonna go by one category I don't know um, which one do I want to pick uh, affiliate marketing let's just go to affiliate marketing which is kinda of broad and I'm going to filter this down. So these are all in one category. So they're all connected by the category, which is categories and tags is a whole different ball game here. If you're not, if you don't know how to use your categories and tag pages, then um, we we have an SEO course for that. But anyway, um, so I am. I think I'm here. Should I start? Let's see, affiliate marketing. Um, and the more I look at this, the more work I know that I really need to do. You can see here my numbers. Let's see, this one has got some some good links. How I made eight thousand dollars in September. Um, long tail keywords. So this tells me right here. I could expand on on keywords and put some more articles in here and interlink them together to boost my authority. Uh, and another thing that interlinking does is it bridges a gap for you like if you have an information post that gets a lot of traffic but it does, it isn't you know people people you have to understand the different stages that your buyer is in again that's in our keyword courses we have a few of them but you know you can target with the same topic you can target um the information people the people that are searching then you can lead them down the path and interlink to um a post that is more buyer focused so it bridges the gap between your information post and your um, your posts that are more profitable is what I'm trying to say. It really will help. And if you're not doing this, I'm just going to say you're missing out. If you don't know how to do this, um, you should get our SEO course and our buyer keyword course. And we also have a targeting course. All of those really do go to dive into this stuff but this is a big deal and I am um, very aware that people aren't doing it and I also am aware that people are not doing it correctly you have to rel if you're going to link from one post to another they have to be highly relevant to one another you can't just link to something because the word is in there you're gonna lose your audience they're gonna click on that link thinking they're getting more information on the topic you're talking about and if you're taking them to something entirely different you probably just lost them so I just really wanted to um, talk about this a little bit because this is a big deal. Uh, we really go deep into this in our VIP group. Uh, we, we actually put blog posts up and and go in depth about it and, and, and give a plan of action even. So, but um, in the big group where I'm posting this, we, we don't get into it quite as much. So anyway, I just wanted to um, talk about that. It's very, very big deal if interlinking. It's huge, huge, huge 
for your SEO okay so understanding and creating an internal link profile and there's other things to it too and I'll, I'll get into that probably I don't know but you know like the different kinds of links you've got the anchor links you've got the naked links there's also a, a, an art to your link profile but I'm not going to get into that right now I'm just going to tell you you better start interlinking if you're not doing it and I'll talk to you later